Kelly Rowland consulted Jay-Z for guidance before to reaching out to her father who was estranged. Kelly Rowland believes that Jay-Z's guidance enabled her to mend fences with her father. Before contacting Christopher Lovett in 2018, the Motivation singer had not seen him in almost 30 years. She commended the 99 Problems hitmaker who is married to her close friend Beyonce for encouraging her to make the jump to visit him. Love is all about risk, he remarked, according to her statement on Today. You must choose whether or not to leap. Are you going to jump? He questioned me, saying, are you going to jump? The 41-year-old actress, who is married to Tim Weatherspoon and has two children, Titan, 7, and Noah, 14 months, was raised by her mother when her father decided he wasn't ready for parenting. Kelly has always felt as if something was missing from her life. I had a great mother who loved and supported me, but the truth is, there was always a part of me that was kind of missing, the woman said. My dad was not present in my life for 30 years. After Titan was born and her mother passed away in 2014, the former member of Destiny's Child felt it was time to reconnect. She met Christopher at an Atlanta hotel and listened to him talk for two hours. She broke down in tears as she remarked, I realize that we are not flawless, and it saddened me to think that my children might be let down by anything about me. Obviously, you don't do anything on purpose. You must make room. It's okay that you won't get everything perfect every time. I had to extend my father's mercy. It is our duty as parents to provide grace to our parents. It's always possible. There is always room for forgiveness. During her interview, Kelly's father joined her, describing their meeting as like a dream. Meanwhile, the dilemma hitmaker said that in order for Kelly to go on and heal, she needed to hear Christopher tell her he loved her. That was necessary to the little girl and me that needed to hear that, the woman said. It was essential to hear it from a male source. Hearing that directly from my father was essential, and it made sense psychologically when I considered all the turbulent relationships and attempts to understand men. Therefore, everything comes back to the abandonment problem when I question therapists about this.